Amy Bien. Um, I'm here at Powerhouse Gym, downtown Tampa. I'm here with my trainer, Carmen Dembski, and I'm a national level uh, competitor, figure competitor, and I'm actually gearing up for the Florida State in seven days, eight seven days? days? Seven days. Um, eight days. Eight. Anyway, <laughs> right next weekend, right around the corner. Um, I'm just coming off of doing Southern States uh, last month. Um, came in third place, so we're gonna try this again next week and see how it goes. So um, we're gonna go through, and she's gonna get me through a back workout, and we're gonna finish up with just a little bit of shoulders. So we'll take you through and show you what we do. Such a sweet star. <laughs> Setting it. I've been competing since 2006. I started training in 2005. My first show was in 2006, um, Lakeland Classic, and placed second. And shortly after that, went on to the Hurricane, Tim Gardner's Hurricane, and placed first. And did a few more shows that year, placed um, in all of those. The following year, I loved it so much. Uh, I did about four or five shows the following year. Um, placed in almost all of them as well. Um, and I've been competing ever since. I know for me, I uh, have not a problem with gaining muscle. There was one point in time where I even felt about dabbling into bodybuilding because of the physique and the way that uh, figure was going. Uh, I chose not to. I decided to stay in the in the figure arena, and then they came out with uh, women's physique this year. Uh, a couple people urged me to do it. I thought about it. I tossed it around back and forth, but I decided to stay with figure. Um, since I've been with Carmen, I've noticed some good changes in my physique that I was really wanting to happen. Um, leaving out my legs trying to make them not as muscular. Not that it's a bad thing to be muscular. I love it. <laughs> but um, I wanted to see how far I can go in figure. Obviously, I would love to one day get my pro card. If not, I enjoy the sport so much, and I love coaching as well. So I usually do um, five-day workout. Um, I usually train um, shoulders, and biceps one day. Um, I try to train, uh, train my hamstrings and glutes at least twice a week. Um, quads, I don't lift any weights. Yeah. Um, no need to. Uh, and then I do back and triceps. And shoulders another day and abs every other day. <laughs> and I did those yesterday. And I'm feeling it today.
little tired seeing that my show is next weekend, so getting a little bit of carbs, not much, but I'm going to push through. So we're going to super set some dumbbell rows. been a nurse for 17 years um, and I love that I would never give up for the world and it kind of helps being in this industry and able to share with um, the patients I deal with because I do home health nursing and they see my physique they see and they always question it so I love to share my experiences um, and my knowledge with them as well um, that being said I also um, train girls for shows as well. I have my own website, www.amyabnbien.com, um, and you can look me up there. I have a little video snippets on there for workouts, um, some of the um, fees that you can get for coming on to join the team with me uh, and get you to wherever you want to go as far as if it's wanting to compete or if it's just wanting to lose a little bit of weight that gets you to where you want to feel comfortable. And I personally have been, um, I have two children. I have a 14, almost 15 year old and an eight year old. And when my son, my first son was first born, I had, I went above and beyond when I was pregnant and gained almost 70 pounds. So after I had him, I was nearly 220 pounds. So I've been on the other end, so I know what it's like to be overweight. It took me almost two years to get it off, which is kind of where I started coming into wanting to um, get real fit. And that's when I became um, interested and found out about the industry of competing. I've been doing a lot of circuit training as well this year. Um, trying to make my legs a little leaner, um, a little longer, less muscular. Um, my legs have always come in very muscular. I've been blessed with the fact that I have good genetics. But sometimes they've come in too, a little too bulky. As far as nutrition, um, it's a little bit different. I've done a lot of research, um, being that I am a trainer myself. Um, even though I have a trainer, I do train others, and I always need that second eye, which is why I have more carbon on my side. Um, being a nurse, um, I deal with a lot of nutrition as well, so I like to find out a lot more about it, not only for my own personal um, physique and the girls that I train, but as well as being a nurse and helping the patients that I deal with. Um, and in my research, I've come across um, and experimented a little bit on the um, blood type dieting and have implemented not only the girls that I train um, for shows, I also train the girls for shows as well, um, but also implemented it in my diet, which is one of the reasons why I, I stay with Carmen and I went with Carmen. We both think um, on the same level and ironically, when I was explaining to her that I was researching it, she had been researching it too. So we're always on the same page. Um, and in doing so, I've adjusted my diet accordingly to that and have made some very interesting, found out some interesting things about my physique, my body, what my body tolerates according to my body type. Um, as well as the girls I train. Um, they've been really happy and really pleased with, um, with the diet and nutrition that I've adjusted for them as well due to it. And um, it's paid off. So I've um, done a lot of um, protein. I, I don't necessarily go by the every two hour rule. Um, I eat about five to six times a day and I spread it out accordingly depending on what my stomach is telling me. Um, morning times I'm not that hungry so I tend to spread my meals out later in the afternoon when I get my tummy talking to me more so um, and it's worked out great um, 
I also am not doing any supplementation this year, and the girls I train, um, I haven't had them doing any supplementation as, um, except for Juice Plus, which is a whole food um, capsule. It is not necessarily supplement. It's um, a, a capsule that I take that has 17 fruits and vegetables and grains in a capsule form. Um, and I've been taking that for a couple months and noticed significant um, improvement in my physique, in my energy levels. Um, I don't feel or experience the highs and lows that you get during dieting um, with the Juice Plus. And the longer that I've been on it, the more positive results and feelings I get. Um, on a day-to-day -day basis, and this, I'm getting the same feedback from the people that I've put on it as well. Um, so since I believe in the product so much, I became a distributor. Um, I love it. I have my own website, www.amyeeloveshoesplus.com, and um, people can always go there and order. Um, if they're interested. Or you can read up about it. There's, it's been around for 43 years, 42 years, I believe. So it's not a, something new. And like I said, it's not a supplement. It's just to bridge the gap from the fruits and vegetables that we don't get on a daily basis. And especially when you're dieting and competing and getting ready for shows, you're not getting as much uh, fruits, obviously, because of the simple sugars and the vegetables that we usually, our bodies need. Burning it out. A little bit of pain. <sighs> it takes pain to be beautiful. It is. <laughs> it's a lot of work to look good. We're just gonna touch on a little bit of the shoulders. I'm gonna do it nice and light. Okay. Right. Feel all that work now. I do. <laughs> No pain, no gain, right? <laughs> Another set. So I did 
two national shows last year, um, junior nationals. I just barely made the top 15, and then master nationals where I didn't place at all. This year, uh, I just did Southern State, came in third, got my requalification for nationals again, and I'm about to Florida State next weekend and we'll see what happens there. I'm really excited. I have a lot of good friends competing in the show. And we'll see what happens. And then as far as next year, I will be hitting the national level stage next year again. Not sure what shows I'll be doing, but um, I'm anxious to continue with the improvements and the changes that I've been doing with my diet, with my nutrition and supplementation, with the Juice Plus. And improving to see what I can do next year on the national level.